if you have four or five category then pie chart is best to visualize your data set but if you have more than five category pie chart is not good option to visualize your data set in this example i have seven category of age and how much is their count using column chart i can easily display this data set and using dual label i can perfectly see the percentage as well as the count for the same data if we develop the pie chart look at the difference it's very hard to read so that's why i develop the dual data label chart which help you to visualize your data sheet in a much better way no further ado let's go together consider we have this data sheet the first thing we simply create the chart so i'm just going to select all of the data sheet go to insert recommended chart and i will select column chart and just hit ok the next thing i will do a little bit formatting i'm just selecting this chart design click all of the data label hit delete key and now click any of the column right click format data cities on the fill and line color i will choose fill and i will select vary color by point the next thing i just want to decrease the gap width to increase the size of the column so click series and options and decrease the gap width to let's say 10 percent now the next thing to develop the customized data label first we need to develop percentage data label then we develop amount data label and then we will combine it so how we can develop percentage data label if i type equal click b2 divide by sum and result of all column so i'm just going to select hit f4 key close the bracket hit enter this will give me the percentage if i drag this formula down this will calculate percentage for each of the value if i double click you can see this is the percentage belong to p5 now we will use text function because if we want to apply the data label on Excel chart, we must need to use text function. So I'm just writing text function. Where is the value? So the value is my whole function result format. In this case, I want 0.0% format. Close the bracket for text function, hit enter, and this will create percentage for all of the column value. The next thing we just need to format this count using text function to a proper number so text select b2 format in this case i want hash comma hash hash zero quotation mark close the bracket hit enter and we will get formatted number the next thing we just need to combine both of the data label into one data label column so i'm just going to click clipboard clear all first select the first b2 cell select all of the formula hit ctrl c now select d2 all of the formula ctrl c so we just store our formula now we will write text join function for the text join function delimiter i will use line break so how you can define line break in excel formula so corrected 10 is a function which actually insert line break within a formula in ignore parameter i don't want to ignore anything so i'm just going to write false now the text one where is the text one so text one is actually our percentage formula so i'm just going to remove the equal sign comma and text two is our count formatted formula so i'm just select this one of course i need to remove the equal sign close the bracket hit enter and this will generate percentage and number as well of course if i just click warp text it will properly display the result i think we also need to insert the bracket so how we can insert the bracket we just need to modify this formula a little bit so quotation mark open the bracket quotation mark again and percent and on the end we also need and percent quotation mark close the bracket and percent and hit enter now we just need to drag this formula down till our data sheet of course we don't need those two columns so i'm just select and delete those two columns now what we need to do we simply click on the chart plus simple data label more options and value from cell select all of the value hit ok and uncheck the value close this window choose the black color for your data label you can choose any of the colors and our chart is ready we just need to close this clipboard of course we need to hide this column as well but my data label again hidden so we just need to click chart chart design select data sheet hidden and empty row click show hidden row hit ok and this is how we can create dual data label chart in excel i hope you enjoyed this video please subscribe my channel for more video thank you so much